49ers are ready for what's next. I think we're pretty well positioned. Uh, I think everything's in front of us, which is what you hope for at this point. First up on the agenda, Sunday night football against that other L.A. team, the Chargers. They provide a great challenge um, on both sides of the ball. The 49ers used bye week to get healthier on both sides of the ball, and now they just want to stay that way. This is the grind of the season now. This is the stretch we're about to go on, um, and we need all our weapons. We'll see those weapons in action on Sunday Night Football, and we're getting you ready for the game with analysis, interviews, and more right now on Red and Gold Zone. Welcome to Red and Gold Zone. I'm your host, Kate Rooney. And just like that, the second half of the NFL season is upon us. The 49ers are 4-4. Four four. It's time for them to make a real run if they want another shot at the NFC Championship. Which brings us to our top storylines of the week. Unfortunately, we have to start with injury news. Cornerback Jason Verrett tore his Achilles tendon in practice on Wednesday, ending his season before it really began. Verrett has spent all season working to come back from an ACL tear, and the 49ers activated him from the physically unable to perform list just two weeks ago. The Achilles is the latest in a long list of injuries that have derailed Verrett's promising career. When he's healthy, he's been effective, but he hasn't been on the field much, dealing with two torn ACLs, a previous Achilles tear and an ankle injury. This is a somber move.